Hey guys, welcome back to another video and if you're new here, my name is Edward Smith and welcome to my YouTube channel and in today's video we are going to be unboxing and reviewing the Atom Audio T5Vs. So before we jump into things, I'd first like to remind you that if you are someone that's interested in home studio gear or you want to learn how to set up your very own home studio, that this channel is for you. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button down below, click on the bell notification so you don't miss any of my future uploads. Secondly, if you end up being interested in these studio monitors, I've also left some links down in the description below. And then last but not least, make sure you stick around all the way till the end so that you don't miss the sound test comparison where I'm going to be comparing these Adam Audio T5Vs to the Caro K Rock. 5G4s. But without any further ado, let's jump into this video and see what these studio monitors are all about. So when you unbox these studio monitors, the first thing that you get is obviously the studio monitors themselves. You get the power cable to power them up and then you also get some paperwork that's not too important. It just tells you a little bit about the series from the Atom Audio T5V, 7V and 8V and a little bit of info about each pair. But the thing that really got me about these studio monitors is the fact that for the last four or five years, I've been looking to get some decent Atom Audio studio monitors. The problem was that they were so expensive. And when these T-Series studio monitors came out and they were targeted at that budget group that are looking for quality studio monitors that have the Atom Audio touch to it, I was really impressed and really excited about getting a pair of these. And today I'm quite excited to look at these first. And I must say that right off the bat, I am personally a big fan of the way that they look. I love the look and design. I love the fact that they're all matte black and simple and straight to the point. It's not too much and it's also not too little. I love the fact that they still have the Adam Audio tweeter which is something that's of very high quality giving you it at a much lower price with this series. Moving on to the back panel of our studio monitors. The first thing that we have is our base reflex port which has a similar design to that of the Yamaha HS5s. We have a low pass filter and a high pass filter which is just just there to help you get a better room setup and room acoustic design and have these sound better for your specific environment and then we also have our volume knob and a power switch and XLR input and all the standard connections that you get when it comes to setting these up perfectly with an audio interface in a home studio environment. So now that we've gone through these studio monitors in terms of overall look and design features and just did a slight overview, it's time to move on to the sound quality test. And as I told you guys in the beginning of this video, I will be comparing these Atom Audio T5Es to the KRK Rocket 5G4s just to see how good they really sound. All this time, I've been feeling hopeless till you came around came around all this time you're the only reason i'm not chasing highs chasing highs what is love lately i've been wondering just what is love what is love i don't know no one ever showed me i've been on my So that brings this video to an end of my unboxing and review of the Adam Audio T5Vs. Just a reminder that if you're interested in these studio monitors, I have left some links down in the description below. Secondly, if you have any questions about today's video, just leave a comment down below and I'll try and get back to you as soon as I can. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you loved it, subscribe down below. And I will see you for another video next time.